What's up guys, Al here from AM Training. So in this session, I am deadlifting heavy-ish. And by heavy-ish, I mean, um, you know, it's not too heavy, but it's kind of heavy, relatively heavy, compared to what I've been doing before. Because before I've been doing 375 or even 325 and really working on pause deadlifts and really making sure that my back isn't rounding. So hopefully all that uh, lighter weight and form uh, seeking is been helping out my low back curve here. So you guys, you know, you guys be the judge for yourself. Uh, for me, when I'm looking back at these little clips here, uh, they look like my training's been working out. Uh, there's still a slight curve, but it's not as bad as it was before. And also it's still sticking to, it's not moving. So there's no movement between uh, all the deadlifts there, or that, at least that's what I can see there. And as you can see that I'm wearing quite elegant attire. I have my little wife beater there along with uh, my tight shorts so with this uh, with this attire here it, it feels like I'm a little scrubby because I think my I mean I'm wearing a wife beater and I think there was even maybe a hole in it but who cares you know I'm lifting some heavy shit and that's when I want to get some you know I want to get some shit done so uh, like I said if there's anything that I can work on let me know but all in all these felt pretty good I did five sets of three for four oh five all right, moving on to some accessory work. As you see here, I'm taller uh, because it's deficit training here. I'm actually standing on like a maybe a two inch plate or maybe one and a half. I'm pretty sure it's two, but this is 315 here. I'm trying to do some stiff legged deadlifts and I feel the crazy stretch here. Um, and this is, I don't quite do these quite often, so I was kind of getting the groove in it. Um, I know um, with this particular one, I was trying not to have the bar so close because I was really trying to work on it as like it was a good morning or something like that. And of course I've been a bro for the past three weeks or so and I've been bench pressing every day. I'm really excited. I'm trying to take advantage of all the progress I'm, I'm uh, having here. So here's 250. Uh, I'm pretty much doing the same workout that I did last uh, uh, the day before this or the last training session before this but the only difference is that I'm really trying to concentrate on the good quality pause because toward the end of the last ses session uh, I think I missed a rep or two and and it didn't it wasn't pausing as much and I do know that while I was doing this it was pretty darn uh, sexy as well, if I say so myself it felt good felt solid felt strong so I'm pretty happy with my progress again and so hopefully that helps out All right, moving on to some accessory work. This is pretty much the same thing I did last time, except this time I am trying to condense it. So instead of doing 25 reps all together through five sets, I'm trying to break it down into three. So that's roughly around eight, eight reps per set. And I'm hoping that this will really speed up my bench again because I just got confirmation that Matt does fitness. Um, I kind of challenged him to who can pause 315 uh, first so hopefully I'm not talking through my ass and I hope I win because I have you know you guys you guys who are subscribed to me I'm pretty much a challenge whore I totally want to win I'm too competitive sometimes is what my wife will say and uh, so whoever benches 315 with a pause uh, wins I don't know about the prizes we really didn't uh, talk about that but it's pretty much bragging rights and you know I am really the type that like to brag so Hopefully I win, but other than that guys, thanks again for watching, train hard, train smart.